Well, brother and sister, this week's Thursday's pets start purring the minute you just look at them. Mary Jane Benning joins us now to introduce us to Ben and JC, and, and they are just purring up a storm. Oh, the motors are going. I know. You're holding Ben. He's our little boy, and I've got JC, and she's a little girl, and they have three siblings at the shelter, so they there are five babies. And they are so much fun to play with. Yeah, they are. They're about 12 weeks old now. They're healthy. They're playful. They're just as cute as they can be. And just you know, typical, healthy, precious kittens. They want to play. They want to hold on. They want to love. They enjoy playing together, which is why our two-for-one cat offer for the month of June is so great because... As I have said before on here, all the Benning cats were adopted in pairs because yes. they keep, and you have your two. Yes. They keep each other company. If you work all day, they play together. They, they keep each other fit and they exercise. They do, and they also sleep together. And they sleep together and they're happy. And you still need one water bowl, one food bowl, and one litter box. That's it's right. not It's not any more hassle for you. And they just love being together. So. As I said, the whole month of June is two for one cat month, whether it's a little bitty cat or a great big cat. Or if you want a big cat and a little cat, you can do that too. We can fix you up. That's exactly right. We got some beautiful right. kitties. And you've got lots of kitties because it is kitten season. It is kitten season. And of course, that's why we always urge people to spay and neuter their pets. Mm -hmm. But because we do have this time of year that rolls around, but it is good news for people who are wanting a baby. Because we got like a baby. <laughs> <laughs> and if you want to foster, now's a great time to Oh, foster fostering too. is so much fun. To see, these guys are big enough and healthy enough to be at the shelter now. But sometimes we get litters that are too small and they can be subject to disease. You know, they can catch something. They can get too cold. They, they need more attention than we can give them at the shelter. Right. And so we need foster families for just short term to nurse them and love them and socialize them and then bring them to us and we'll find a home. Perfect, and tell us about last week's Thursday's pet because we've got great news. Dude has his forever home. I'm so excited. And Lauren, our floor director, was there to see well, the she adoption. She was, Lauren, was, she said, I was so excited. She, I, I don't know why you didn't just yell, yay. <laughs> <laughs> well, tell us, uh, I know we've got several events. We do have events and then we're gonna have a lost pet we wanna talk about. Okay, we'll talk about too. the lost pet in a minute. Okay. Oh, we can, we can talk about you, it. Are you ready Go for the ahead. lost pet? Yes. Okay, because this sounds like a beautiful, beautiful dog. Layla is a three-year-old spayed pit bull. She is blue and white with light green eyes. Doesn't that sound like a beautiful yes. dog? She lives at Jimmy Johnson Boulevard and Ridgewood in Nederland. They said she is a very sweet-natured and gentle dog, and they desperately want her back. Her family loves her very, very yeah, much. You can Smart tell breed loved. of dog. Yes, beautiful girl. And tell us about uh, the Are you events? ready for our events? Yes, All right, quickly. we will be at PetSmart not this Saturday, but next Saturday, the 29th, from 11 to 4. Mm -hmm. We will have, uh, you can go by the Kickstand Bike Shop in the Colonnade and mm -hmm. register for our bike ride that's in August. Mm -hmm. And let's see, we need fosters for these guys. I want to urge people to please go on our website, go on Facebook. If you see these kittens and you can't adopt them, but you have some friends who might, Go on Facebook and say, you need to go down to the shelter and see our babies because really our website and Facebook are really helping us do adoptions. It's, it's a fun way. You can come down to the shelter, take pictures of animals, put them on your Facebook, check our Facebook and go to petsforpeople.org and we got lots and lots of beautiful animals yeah. that need home. All right, Mary Jane, thanks. We appreciate it. Hopefully Thank you. we'll have good news about Ben and JC next week. I hope so too.